Hey guys, my name is Ankit Bharia and welcome back to the channel. Now we are in Abu Dhabi right now and we are going to shoot a video on Renault 7 Pro and we are going to show you how you can take cinematic shots using just your phone you know what are the camera techniques, what are the camera angles so all those things we are going to be talking about in this video so without reading much, let's just start it and dive into the video we will be showing you 10 different type of shots that you can take to shoot any video and that is going to be really helpful so keep watching so the first shot is follow forward in which you will follow the subject from front and here we're going to use the bouquet flare portrait mode of oppo Reno 7 pro now in this shot we are following the subject with a slight angle and it's a mid shot and that really gives a cinematic look the bouquet flare portrait mode works in the night as well and it feels like you're using a DSLR as city lights create amazing flares and here is another full wide shot and a close up of hands and don't forget to capture the surrounding shots as well because this really helps in the editing the second shot is follow backward in which the camera will follow the subject from behind and we're going to use the ultra study feature of oppo reno 7 pro to get the stable shots handheld now there are different type of shots that we can take and here's the one i'm following the subject exactly from behind and it's a full tight shot the other one is following with almost a 30 degree angle like not exactly from behind but with a slight angle and this will give a variation to the shot and now this one is a full wide shot and the last one is tight mid shot so you can combine all these shots in the editing to make a mix out of it the third one is a reveal shot as it says you're going to reveal the subject now there are different ways to reveal the subject and a lot of people use these kind of shots in the travel videos so here are all the samples we took and you can try any of these techniques remember one thing when you're taking shots in such terrain like stairs then don't walk like this it's very risky and also the shot won't look good just simply walk with a face looking forward the fourth one is the jib shot and again there are a couple of ways to shoot the first one being the most simple you know just take the camera up and let the subject pass the frame the next one is adding a slight movement like the camera is going up as well as away from the subject the next one is with the camera going up just add a follow track as well and the last one is taking the shot with a side angle so with that you get all the variations the fifth one is the parallel tracking here you follow the subject with the camera moving in the parallel direction and we are going to use the AI highlight feature of Oppo Reno 7 Pro which will give us a HDR look so the one you're seeing is the mid shot and you can shoot in a couple of ways like here is the full body shot and we'll just follow the subject in the parallel direction also don't do this when you're doing the parallel track the shot won't look stable on the other hand this is the correct way just simply walk looking forward and the shot you will get will be really really stable the sixth one is an orbit shot basically you will take a circle around a subject and it can be a semicircle like this one and you can also take a full orbit shot and add some speed up transitions later on if needed the seventh one is a continuous shot and it's one of my favorite one in which you will follow the subject as it moves around take a look at this example here we start with following the subject from behind and as she stops the camera also stops and as she start turning around the camera movement changes and the camera moves around her and then as she goes ahead so again we start following her so basically you're just combining all those different camera moves which I have shown you previously so with this one shot you will get all the variations all the kind of shots you can get with this just simple one the eighth one is what I call a masking shot you can use any object as a foreground which we use to mask our subject like you can use this 
or you can use a tree or if you find nothing then literally you can use your hand to mask a subject so for example this is the shot number one where we cover the subject with the big pole in the foreground and that's the shot number two like doing the same thing here so look at the final edited shot and see how seamless it looks here is another example where we cover the subject passing the camera along the tree and now see this different outcomes of how we can use this trick to show the viewers moving the subject from one place to another here we can also use the ai color portrait mode of opera 7 pro to get the creative look the ninth one is the tilt up shot in which you will make the phone camera angle to look in the upward direction for this shot, we're going to use the 4K feature of Oppo Reno 7 Pro to get the best quality. Now see this sample, if your camera is looking upward, it makes everything look big and to show the movement, you can use anything in the foreground like we're using these tree branches here. Here is another example where I'm just slowly panning around a subject with the camera looking slightly up. The 10th and the last shot is the transition shot and we will be using in-camera transition tricks here like see these samples just pan the camera very fast and as you get close to the subject then just slow it down and again in the end pan the camera very fast and here is the final outcome So this way you can combine multiple shots and it will give you a seamless transition. So guys that's it from this video. I hope you got to know all the kind of shots that we can take and with the tricks and the transitions. I hope you learned a lot and with that said if you like the video then do give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for future videos and I will see you in the next one. Till then take care, bye bye, dhanyavad.